Right, so I'm going to tell you guys a little bit of an audition story that I had for a TV show called The X Files. Well, I um, had an audition for the TV show The X Files, and I get the script at home. My agent or manager sends the script. It didn't have a lot of lines because we were playing soldiers in a virtual reality video game in this episode, and um, it didn't have a lot of lines. It had like screaming and yelling like, come on, let's go. Flank right, flank left. I got him, yeah. So I didn't know how to perform this <laughs> script. There wasn't a lot of acting, it was just action. And I'm a fat guy and I don't really do action very well. But the character specifically wanted a 250 pound virtual reality nerd video game person. And luckily I was bald at the time, you know, sometimes I shave my head because I got real thin hair, but I like shaving my head and I look kind of cool, you know, I kind of kind of look like a, a tough guy. You know, being bald always makes you look a little tougher. Go to this audition, and again, I only have like yelling, like, come on, let's go. And it was a producer session, meaning Chris Carter, the creator of The X-Files, was gonna be in the room. And I knew this going in, so I'm sitting in the hallway thinking about, and I see actors going in and out, you know, just going in, and I can, I can kind of hear them saying their lines or their yelling, because some of them, are for the same character that I'm going out for. And I was just, I, I don't know, I just, I wanted to do something different. I like to be unique in everything I do. So in this audition, when the casting director came out, they're like, Michael Bauer, are you ready? I'm like, yes, I am. Supposed to introduce me. This is Michael Bauer reading for, for the part of Low Fat. So she walked into the room and then I closed the door behind her and I said, Let's go! Flank right! Flank left! Let's kill these guys! Go! 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 I started the scene the minute I walked in the room. And Chris Carter, the casting director, and another writer were there. And I got them off of the couch. I started saying, get up! Get up! I need your back! Get up! But I forced them, and then Chris Carter went along with it. He gets up, and then I'm like, get behind the couch! We, we need coverage! We need coverage! All right, we're gonna go here, we're gonna go there. You're gonna cover my blind side. We're gonna go in there. We're gonna kill these motherfuckers. They literally got behind the couch with me and I'm looking at them like this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And then I run around the couch where they're kind of like standing and kneeling behind the couch. And then I do my scene where I get shot and I go, oh, oh, oh. And then I fall and then I die like in the virtual reality, but I did it and they were all behind the couch. I said, thank you all. I hope you had a fun day. And then I left. Well, needless to say, I drove home. It took me about 30 minutes to get home. And about 10 minutes after I got home, I had a phone call from my manager saying, Michael, you got the part. So then I ended up going to downtown LA, shoot, learning how to shoot guns and training with them. And I got the part. So sometimes when you take chances in life, good things will happen. 10 seconds to engagement. Yeah. Yeah. Stats, combat ready. Situation, guerrilla units in the immediate vicinity of insertion module. Look at these heart rates. If I don't let these boys out, they're gonna kill each other. Their geeks looking to fry your huevos.
Whoa, it's a total massacre out there. Down. You got me, Moxie? Got you covered. 